Hey, what's up, you guys? Today's video, we're going to be changing now a an air filter, just like this one right here. Uh, <clears throat> uh, part number. If you're interested in the part number, uh, it's right there. Look, it looks like it's a uh, P six zero seven nine five five. Uh, this is a power core by Donaldson and basically all we're going to be doing is taking off the old one this nasty dirty old one and we're going to be putting in a brand new one so all you need is a Phillips head screwdriver to take off this bolt or I'm sorry this screw this screw and this screw and the new one goes in just like just as easily so let's go ahead and get started I got this uh, drill. You don't really need this, but I like to use it every time I get a chance. This is actually not that dirty. Look, super blue. Oh, I'm a little surprised to see that. I thought it'd be a lot dirtier. But that's okay. We're going to go ahead and change it anyways. Um, it's been about a year since the last time I changed it. So if you actually go to... Um, if you actually go to Freightliner, or the first time that I went to Freightliner, better yet, to buy one of these filters, they sold also sold me this piece right here. It was sold separately. They said it had been an updated version because the last one had like a uh, cotton mesh sheet right here. And now, as you can see, this one is actually a metal one. Uh, I guess it's supposed to last longer. So this stays. And if you have the other one, I, I guess it's fine too. Because um, when you buy, I bought this one on Amazon because the the dealer has the uh, has this one for like seventy five dollars. Amazon has it for fifty dollars. And actually, the last time I bought them, they were actually forty five dollars, so they went up about five bucks. But it's still cheaper than Freightliner. So I'm gonna go ahead and just screw line it up line it up and then we're just going to screw it back in how often are you supposed to change your filter I'm not really sure I do mine every once a year and uh, it seems like once a year may be too often And that's pretty much it guys the old one is out the new one is in um, <clears throat> one thing that I did want to show you was this uh, so it comes with this is already this was already there but mine doesn't work you're supposed you're supposed to push it right here and then you'll feel the little spring move in there and then it's supposed to measure basically how much air is going in to your engine or how dirty your filter is and I guess that's how you know when you're supposed to replace it mine broke I found something similar or it may be the exact same one it's hard to tell it looks the same I don't know if it is the same on Amazon for like 40 I think it was like somewhere between 40 and 50 dollars but the filter itself is also 40 dollars so I just went ahead and I bought the filter instead of buying this and this at the same together I just went ahead and bought this once a year, 45 bucks. So I don't think it's that bad. So that's it, guys. Thanks for watching.